The Saab J-35 Draken is a Swedish supersonic fighter aircraft that played a significant role in the Cold War era. Developed by Saab in the 1950s, the Draken became an iconic symbol of Swedish engineering prowess and innovation. The Saab J-35 Draken, meaning Dragon in Swedish, was designed to fulfill the Swedish Air Force's requirement for a high-speed interceptor capable of countering potential threats from Soviet bombers. The project began in the late 1940s and the first prototype flew in 1955, with production commencing in 1959. One of the most distinctive features of the Draken is its double delta wing design. The double delta wing, characterized by two sharply angled triangular sections, provided excellent maneuverability at both low and high speeds. This unique wing design also allowed for a high degree of stability and enabled the aircraft to maintain control even at extreme angles of attack. The Draken was powered by a single afterburning turbojet engine, which gave it impressive speed and climb capabilities. Its maximum speed exceeded Mach 2, twice the speed of sound, allowing it to intercept and engage incoming enemy aircraft effectively. The aircraft's engine, combined with its aerodynamic design, gave the Draken the ability to perform quick turns and rapid acceleration, making it a formidable adversary in the air. In terms of armament, the Draken was equipped with a variety of weapons to engage different types of targets. It typically carried two 30mm cannon for close-range combat. The aircraft could also be armed with air-to-air -air missiles, such as the AIM-4 Falcon and later the AIM-26 Falcon, as well as air-to-surface missiles and rockets. The Draken's weapon systems were continuously upgraded throughout its service life to maintain its effectiveness. The Draken's advanced avionics and radar systems were also noteworthy. It was one of the first fighter aircraft to employ a pulse Doppler radar, which allowed for detection and tracking of targets even in adverse weather conditions. The radar system, combined with a data link, enabled the Draken to conduct effective beyond visual range engagements and coordinate with ground control units. The Draken served as the primary interceptor for the Swedish Air Force from the 1960s until its retirement in 2005, an impressive operational span of over four decades. In addition to Sweden, the aircraft was exported to several other countries, including Austria, Denmark, and Finland, where it remained in service for many years. The Draken's contribution to aviation extended beyond its role as an interceptor. Its unique design and technological innovations influenced subsequent aircraft development, both in Sweden and internationally. The lessons learned from the Draken's design and operation were applied to subsequent Saab aircraft, such as the Saab Vigan and Gripen. Overall, the Saab J-35 Draken was a groundbreaking aircraft that combined advanced aerodynamics, powerful engines, and innovative avionics to create a highly capable interceptor. Its distinctive appearance, exceptional maneuverability, and long service life make it a legendary aircraft in aviation history, embodying the Swedish commitment to excellence in engineering. Comment below of which aircraft I should talk about next and subscribe for more and if I hit 1000 subscribers I will talk about ground vehicles.